What's up world? My name is Sarah. Welcome back to another episode of whatever it is that we're doing here. It's just, like I said, I'm going to be on the fence with a lot of these pieces. So some of these pieces have to go. When Harry met Sally, help me. I never put this on. So there's something about it that about this next one. I don't know why it's less than five hard to choose so a for sure donate donate with a lot of things <laughs> tops i'm getting ideas barbie wasn't my go-to thing dolls in general i never we keep this one now i have been going through my closets again decluttering things that i haven't been wearing and i'm on the fence with a lot of these items we're diving into tops knits hoodies and other tops so i really need your help on this one what do i let go and donate and what do i keep because some of them have to go and uh, yeah it's hard to choose so let's dive in now this first item is a beautiful purple fleece that as soon as i put on i am like i said i'm gonna be on the fence with a lot of these so i really need help now this is a great piece especially for this season that we're in i know i have a bunch of similar items but this is just there's something about it that uh, i don't know I haven't been wearing it, but that's probably because we haven't been in the season. So is it that or is it something else? Is this a keep? What do you think? It's comfortable on. It's just, yeah. This is going to be a hard to say no to, but then not. Let me explain. So this is a white knit that I thrifted because I like that. Remember that movie when when Harry met Sally and Billy Crystal has that white knit on? This is kind of like that. The only reason why I haven't been wearing this one is because the sleeves are a weird length. They're not short enough and they're not long enough. It's just a weird fit. Otherwise, like the, the body part, the neckline, the knit, everything about it is perfect. It's just... Can I wear a long sleeve t-shirt underneath and make it work, do you think? Or is this definitely donate for somebody that the knit fits better? Yeah. What do you think? Keep? Donate? But this is a fun item because the color is, I don't know, I'm starting to like pink on me and I don't know why. I wasn't into pink for the longest time and uh, now it's kind of my thing, I think. So this is a fun knit. It has a bit of like a sheen to it and the design is cute. It's just, I haven't been wearing this particular knit even though I am into knit and into pink. So does she keep it? I don't know. It, I, like I said, I'm gonna be on the fence with a lot of these pieces. I think this is vintage too, like. We keep this one okay again with that pink color i mean it it looks like i i think pink might be certain pinks at least might be my new favorite color to wear it's just maybe i'm going through a pink obsession phase which reminds me i still haven't seen the new barbie movie but to tell you the truth i've never had my own barbie I, i've only played with barbies that weren't mine and even that was very brief. And I can only remember one friend that would allow me to play with her Barbies. Yeah. Barbie wasn't my go-to thing. Dolls in general. I never had that in me. Playing with dolls and, and I don't know. I'm more of a Lego building block drawing kind of kid. But this pink is just, yeah. I don't know, do, do I keep this? I mean, the fabric is nice and it fits so comfortably on, but yeah, some of these pieces have to go. Is this one of them? More beautiful knits. This is a beige grayish kind of color with three quarter sleeves. It's cotton, it's nice and soft. I mean, I'm not sure, maybe the fit is why I haven't been wearing it. Not that it's uncomfortable in the sense, it's just maybe, I don't know. 
sometimes 100% cotton mitts are stiff, if you know what I mean. Like, it's like, not hard, but it's just, it's stiff. And even though this drapes really nicely on, it's just, I, help me, what do I do? <laughs> I really don't know what to do with this one. Now, there are a couple of items, this one included, that have glitter in them, and I don't know if I am now, I'm not over glitter, obviously, but maybe for a couple of these. This is a bat sleeve, beigey, glittery top that, if you, if you know me, this is a top that I gravitate towards, like the bat sleeve in general. I like that relaxed look, especially when it's kind of fitted around the waist so it can kind of sit nicely. Nothing wrong with this. But all season, when this was kind of in season, I, I, never, I never put this on, so maybe donate this one? What about this next one? Again, it's a knit with some glittery yarn woven into it and this is an extra large one i still like the bat sleeve look and the feel of it now this doesn't really tuck around the waist the way the previous one did so i don't know i'm like some of these have to go some of them i can keep but this is where i need your help like please <laughs> let a girl know and for our third glittery again this is the same color as the first glittery shirt but it's just a different style now this could be fun to wear in the winter as a layering piece but do you wear another knit underneath or is it like more of a white button up with it because as is it's a summer top, at least for me and how I like to style it, but could this work as a layering piece and how would you layer it? Or is this just donate and forget about it? What do you think? Now, this is a great hoodie that I haven't worn in years and the total amount of times that I've worn this is less than five probably. But there's nothing wrong with this hoodie. It's a great sports hoodie, has that pink, again, that looks really good on me. Gray is one of my favorite, all-time favorite colors to wear. And for some reason, this just gets stuck behind everything else and I don't know. Shout out to a great hoodie that should be worn. How do I get myself to wear this? Like, what? Why am I not wearing this? Maybe I should leave it on for the day and then kind of give it a chance like that. I, I, I don't know, what do you think? Donate, keep. For our last item, this is going to be a for sure donate. And when you see it, you're gonna be like, why would you donate it? But let me tell you, unfortunately, this soft, comfortable home hoodie that is super soft and comfortable. And there's just like, when I thrifted this, it was, I thought I'm gonna be lounging in this all day, every day, but turns out that because the embroidery is actual embroidery and it comes through on the other side, this itches me. Now, yes, I could wear a bunch of layers and that's fine too, but this is something that I would like to throw on after I shower in the evening when I watch my shows or a movie and I might not have anything underneath, but that's kind of how I would like to just put this over after I dried myself from the shower and this itches me. So it's not for me. So this is a definite donation and I'm hoping somebody can get some use out of this because otherwise the whole shebang is so nice and soft and there's nothing wrong. There's a hood and it's just snuggly, cozy. It's a wearable blanket that itches me. Now, this is where I need your help. Please comment below or send me a DM and let me know which ones to donate and which ones to keep because yeah, I really appreciate your thoughts and opinions because sometimes you get stuck in your own head with a lot of things, <laughs> but it's just sometimes it's, you just, you can't see from where you're at. And uh, yeah, I uh, would really love to hear your opinions on all the items and uh, yeah, that pink is lingering and 
I'm getting ideas. Now, go ahead, like this video. That always helps me out. And remember to subscribe to the channel so you can find a way back for next week's video. Like I said, I have a spark, an itch. Yeah, I think I know what I'm gonna do next week. Stay tuned. Toodaloo.